Welcome back to Tiki TV. In this episode, we are going to learn how to drive a manual car. In the States, it's it's easy to drive. Two things to consider: your brakes and your gas. That's it. It's easier to drive uh, an automatic transmission because there's no way that your car is gonna stall. So that's one factor that goes with beginner drivers they don't have to worry about their car stalling unlike a manual transmission that is going to be the challenge how to keep your car running all the time how to drive a manual transmission let's just learn those pedals first you have clutch pedal you have your brake pedal and you have your gas pedal how to keep your car from stalling that is the focus of this lesson and the answer is going to be your clutch and we're going to learn it in a Volkswagen <laughs> Mrs. O is going to accompany us in this lesson it's going to be fun automatic transmission only has two pedals it's the brakes in your gas pedal then you have your gear you just put it in drive and then your car goes you don't have to worry about anything anymore your car is not gonna stall now we go to a manual transmission there are going to be three pedals one is going to be for the clutch pedal you're actually going to use your left foot this time so left foot is going to be for the clutch pedal you always have to use your left foot with regards to your your clutch pedal gears usually it's a standard H so when they say standard H it's like a letter H where this is going to be your first gear second gear middle would be your neutral and then again third gear and then fourth gear what is the purpose of your clutch your clutch releases your gear in an automatic transmission your vehicle does it for you so you don't have to worry about anything that's why you only need your brakes and your gas pedals you have to make sure that you know the the orientation of your gear most of the time it's a standard H first gear second gear neutral third gear fourth gear reverse gear with Mrs. O we only have four gears the clutch enables you to change gear from first to second to third to fourth every time you're going to stop in order for your car not to stall every time you're going to change gears you have to make sure you push your clutch all the way down and then change gears orientation of your gears always have to be from one, two, three, four, whenever from a stop, you always have to go first gear. Second gear is not gonna be that strong. So you always go to your strongest gear, which is the first gear. The orientation of your gear will always have to be going up. You can't go from first gear to fifth gear, fifth gear to first gear things like double clutching that's a totally different topic that's for the pros we're just learning how to drive a manual transmission you have to make sure 
that you put your car in neutral every time you're at the stop. Okay, slowing down, you also have to use your your clutch because you need to lower your gear. So you have to go. Maybe you're at the fourth gear, then you go slowly. Third, second gear, and go all the way to neutral if you are at a full stop. Start your engine, make sure when you start your engine, your gear is on neutral. Because if it's in a maybe first, second gear, then you will always jump. Okay, when reversing, you have to make sure you use your clutch. Again, push the clutch all the way and then go to your reverse gear. Then start reversing. Every time you're driving uh, a manual transmission, you have to make sure that you keep balancing your clutch, your gas, and your brakes in order for them to work cohesively and your car is not going to stall. transmission this is where the fun never ends this concludes our episode for today hope I was able to help you out on how to drive a manual transmission once you learn how to drive a manual transmission it completes the journey it completes the driving experience and then you choose your preference so it's up to you now if you want to go automatic or manual it's up to you more fun when you drive a manual transmission. This is Tiki TV. Until next time. Bye for now.